G'day mates, home slice here, and welcome back to Vampire. We're up to part 16 now, and we need to head to the sewers here to uh, discover Sean Hampton's secret, apparently. Oh, and it looks like back at the hospital we've got some new dialogue for Lady Ashbury and Sto uh, Dr. Swansea. So, keen to see uh, what that's all about. But let's uh, start moving towards the sewers now. Uh, have a little look around here before I leave. Might be a... Yeah, it looks like there's a little bit to loot. And there's some bloody expensive uh, medical components. Ooh, old newspaper. The bomb exploded just after dawn in front of the Dawson and Dawson Munitions Factory. The largest employer in the district. The detonation smashed the window of all the factories in North Southwark. It's a miracle only two people died in the attack, confirmed Chief Superintendent Alexander Brighton. Is that the explosion that guy was talking about in regards to his wife? How his wife died in the explosion? Uh, I have a feeling it could be. I can't remember the location where he said it was at, but that could very well be... Oh, a burnt letter as well. Miss Paxton, I recently heard that some, uh, Sean Hampton's shelter for months and something, money or support of any kind, without a positive answer from you, I may be something. My boys always got what they wanted, accepted no for an answer. Keep on refusing to answer me, and wet boot boys come kill you and your sister? I don't know. Ooh. For Lottie Paxton. Is that her right here? I'm not sure. To see you again. I think it is. Yeah. Lottie, tell me about the wet boot boys. I know they've threatened you. Edwina Cox wanted me to provide her with information about Mr. Hampton's resources. I refused. Is that not dangerous? Fuck them and their lies. They claim they protect the interests of the neighborhood, but they are just greedy parasites like all the rest. Yeah, that that's it. You sound a bit reckless. Are you sure you're safe? I do praise her courage, because those guys, like, they really would kill her, judged on what we've seen from them so far. Um, but, yeah, I don't really think she would be safe like even at this sanctuary or whatever they call it on neutral ground I think their wet boot boys are definitely crazy enough to attack this place I respect your courage Miss Paxton and I hope life will never wear you down Dr. Reed <laughs> you know how to make a girl blush I am glad you came to the docks whatever your real reasons are well, at least she likes this, I guess. Goodbye. Compared to her sister. At least we've made so, uh, one friend, at least, in this place. But, yes. To the sewers, I believe. Or is there something over here? Oh, there's something to loot. Ah, yep, we can go up there. Nice. What is this pile here? It's like dirt or something? Got a little bit more to loot as well. Okay. Just looking around for more. Oh, there's one to, over there, of course. Just try and avoid them. As much as I can. Really hate those guys. I Level 16. That's not too bad. I can fight that. And it looks like... I can't avoid them. I need to kill at least this one here. Alright, he's down. Wait for my stamina. Yeah, I gotta kill this one as well. Alright, at least they're um, fairly weak. Get some nice loot from them as well. But yeah, I need to kill them so I can... Oh, fuck. Oh shit, there's some guys over there too. Well, I need to kill these guys to get through. Oh, got that nasty attack in. Let me use this. 
Holy shit, we took a lot of damage, actually. Oh, I'm so lucky I, I was able to kill him. Before he got his uh, shot off. Get a bit more health. Oh, shit. Yeah, I knew he'd do that attack. Fuck. Oh, uh, shit. G. Oh, God, that hurts. Please. Yes, we got him. Shit. Kill him! Oh, yes. Get this guy, too. Oh, he's only, uh... No! Oh, God. Yeah, I know, I know. Shit, this bloody gas. That really hurts. I want to get the blood from this guy. There we go. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't have that much range, does it? I'm just going to wait for this to come back a few times. Man, these guys. Alright, that's enough. There we go. Get all this loot back. Had to use all of my blood potions there, which sort of sucked, but just wanted to get them out of the way. Got a overturned boat. But yeah, let's, let's go in there. Probably have a loading screen. Yep. Okay, loading screen over. Let's get back on the move. I hope there's a few rats around here so I can get some blood back. Oh, definitely sounds like there is. They're off in the distance somewhere. So let's try and find them. Don't see any life signs yet, but it is a sewer, so they must be here. Beware, it says. Locked door. Probably use that to come back out of the sewer like the other one we've been through. Ooh, what's this? That doesn't work. Oh, it looks like it opens the door over there. Maybe. Can't use that one. Shit. Okay, we've got a few pus to take. I'll go upstairs here first. Oh, no. Is there no upstairs? I swear I... S yeah, there, there is a level above us. It doesn't look like we can actually get up there. Maybe it's just, like, part of the roof. There must oh. be a way to control the water level in this reservoir. I need to find a wheel. Okay, can we swim? Uh, I'm not going to die if I jump in here, right? Oh, it's shallow. Who knows how deep it could have been. Okay, looks like we've... Uh, is this like a puzzle? Or is it just... Okay, just got to turn that. So that's it. These wheels control the water level. Are there multiple... Wheels, maybe. Yeah, this is not very helpful so far. Don't see any other wheels. This is the only one. And we... Oh, no, there's both. Okay. Just one either side. Okay, that opens that up. Can we jump through? Yes. Okay. wonder what's over here, then. Got a few barrels that can't actually walk up there. That gate should shut properly now. Oh, the barrels are blocking it. I just attacked those barrels just to see if there was like anything inside them. <laughs> Good thing I did that. I had no idea. Alright, now they'll both shut and it'll get blocked off, right? Give it a few seconds and I guess it'll... Uh, drain, but I don't want to... I feel like I'm about to advance, maybe. So I don't want to do it just yet. Or go down there just yet. Looks like there's a few lootable things I missed there. So we will grab those. But I think there was another way I could go here. Got that locked door, but wasn't there another one here? Another way I could go? There were a few paths... 
Okay, so this is just the entrance, right? Yeah, that's the exit. Maybe I'm mistaken. Yeah, I guess I was wrong. It looks like a, more of an open area, so... Pretty easy mistake to make, I suppose. But, yeah, let's use this thing now. There we go. And we can head down. Oh, no, I need to go to the other side. And we looted there. Don't want to miss anything. Alright, here we go with these. Oh, that's not lootable, but we've got some shillings there. And now we can go... Oh, got another wheel there. I missed that one. Looks like it doesn't matter, though. Let's... Oh, that doesn't sound very nice. There was something there. Boss fight coming? I hope not. I have zero blood to... Oh, we can't actually, like, walk over that, so that's got to be deep water. Maybe, anyway. Okay. God, I hope there's, like, a crafting bench or uh, an easy target to drain blood from. Oh, lit. Oh, yeah, I knew it. There's... Oh, shit, there's blood everywhere now, too. Oh, we got a few rats. I can't believe I'm doing this. Yeah, I know. It's... Wait, can I not... Oh, yeah, it just takes a while before I can get another one. This is despicable. Yes, yes, we know, but it must be done. I have this thirst for blood. Can we maybe crawl through here later? How did that even happen? Oh, well, let's keep going. Let's f just follow the blood. Hopefully there's at least, like, one or two more rats on the way. Because I'd really like to get the charge back up. I have a feeling, like, something is about to go down. And Sean Hampton sent us here. And this was apparently supposed to... Like, prove his innocent... Oh, cutscene. Oh, great. Don't jump down there! Didn't even get a good look of... Oh, this guy. These maggots have escaped the wrath of Ascalon for too long. It is time to purge the sewers of their filth. You again. The one they call the sewer dog. Hold your tongue, you boy, or I'll crush you like a maggot. Oh. You've let the beast consume you. Finally, a touch of lucidity. Fuck, we're just gonna have to fight this guy. Oh my god. Alright, well. This is probably gonna be tough. Just gonna try and focus for this one. Oh, oh damn it. Oh shit. So he's got like a bit of a chain attack. Reload. Oh, he's resisting it. Oh, what the hell? Okay. I hate these things. These ones that summon the fucking... Yes, 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 yes. He's actually fairly weak. Alright, so I just gotta dodge these guys for a little while. Then he'll leave this phase. Oi, he really hurts. Gonna use a health thing. Oh, he's doing it again. Oh, boy. Fuck. Oh, where's he gone? How do I... Oh, he, he came down again. God damn it. 
power you cannot comprehend. Oh, yes, we can do this. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Shit. Oh, he's doing this again. I don't have anything. Uh, let's switch this out to the shotgun, right? I have a shot. Yes. Thank goodness. I shall crush you. You found your death in me. Oh boy, get. Oh shit. Oh no. I need to reload. He's super low now. Oh, he's two, one or two shots. Oh, yes. Thank goodness. I almost lost it there. I ran out of all resources. And his attacks do a lot of damage and quite unpredictable. But he's actually just dead. We don't even get, like, any dialogue. There must be something, right? Some sort of... We just need to keep exploring the sewers, apparently. Oh, common trigger path. I wish I got, um, good trigger parts. Because I need that to upgrade my bloody weapon. Wow, that... That's it, though, with that guy. I thought, like, his storyline would go a bit deeper than that, but I guess not. I'm not, uh, complaining, because I thought he'd be a lot stronger than that. Oh, God. Yeah, what happened here? At least one skull escaped Fergal's wrath. Okay, are we... Can we talk to them? Is it going to be a sane skull? I mean... Maybe the big guy was the murderer all along. I surely someone like at the hospital would have noticed him though, and would be like, "Oh, that guy's freakishly large, like triple the size of any normal human." Like, there's got to be something up with that, right? Oh shit! Looks like uh, there was a path back here that I could take. Don't... Oh, yeah, I'm gonna run back here real fast. I could teleport over to the other side. I thought this might lead to a dead end, and then I can go back and teleport, but... Yeah, I wonder which way's the right way. I don't want to miss anything. I want to get all of the loot. Is this... there anything here? Doesn't look like it. Why did it let me teleport over, then? Oh, there's another way here, but does this lead anywhere? Got a loot here. I keep getting common one. Oh, shit. Okay, well, I think that's where I can... Oh, does this just loop around? Okay, I think that is definitely where I continue. But before we... Oh, yep, this is where I started running back before, so there's nothing else down here. Unless I missed something. I hope I didn't, but... Too bad if I did. Let's keep moving. Let's go up now. I'm a little scared, to be honest. Oh, shit. What's... Shit, is this like a... Underground vampire community, or... What is this? The Sewer Skulls Territory. What? This is our domain, not yours. You've been warned. Wait, I saved you from this creature. That must count for something. Thank you. Now go. Go back to the streets and houses. There is no love lost between us, vampire. But thank you. Sean Hampton sent me. Are you the sewer dog? You seem so sad. Um... I guess we'll go for this one. I doubt she's the sewer dog, right? I thought the big guy was. Sean Hampton sent me here. I believe he wanted me to find you. Who are you? But you must know. They call me Old Bridget. And this shelter is where we live. I'm Jonathan Reed. I'm a newborn Egon. 
I'm afraid I'm not sure what's going on. I shall not bend a knee, young Ekon, but I sense your pain. Ask, and I will afford you my attention. Oh, that's good. Yeah, why was he after you? Why was that creature after you? Fergal is the blunt instrument of the Ascalon Club. His masters would see us dead or turned into slaves if they had their way. Why? And yeah, what is he? He's what huge. What the hell was that thing? He wasn't an Ekon or a Skull. They are known as Volkod, an ancient offshoot of immortals. Blood drives them, enrages them. So they're still sort of sane like Jonathan, like they can talk and reason with people, but the blood, the craving for blood is like way stronger for them. So it sends them over the edge like him and they're massive. They're like the big show, like even bigger than the big show. And like, and he's a big dude. What of this Ascalon club? Vampire society's elite in the Empire. They make the rules and enforce their judgment upon us whom they see as lessers. <sighs> There's like hierarchies with everything. It's So it's sort of like a, a class system, but really discriminatory or something, I guess. So is it you that Sean Hampton sent me to find? Perhaps. The sad saint was always kind to us. He must trust you if he reveals our location. I don't trust him. Can he be trusted? He could be a killer. Uh, after all this, I'm pretty convinced that he's not the killer. Maybe someone tried to frame him. Um, I, I don't think it was confirmed. Like there was an eyewitness account or anything that he did it. I'm gonna go for this. I think he can be trusted, and like she said, he must trust me if he sent me here. Uh, it wouldn't make sense otherwise, because, like, I could kill them all, maybe. I, I don't know, but I think he can be trusted. Sean is a skull. All those I've encountered have been violent, crazed creatures. How can he be any different? Maybe because he is the sad saint. Or perhaps... Because I am old Bridget of the Sewer Skulls. Sean killed a patient of mine. And that's just one of the murders he's being hunted for. If you refer to Harriet, she is now among us and under our protection. Harriet Jones is alive. That's it. That's the proof Sean wanted me to find. I must talk to her. No. What? Harriet is not alive. But you can speak to her. I must warn you, she is fragile and may not receive you warmly. I don't understand. Yeah, I don't she either. She is filled with bile and hate. Her mind is sharp as a tack, but her body is so weak. I've never seen its like before. She is resting in a room on the far right of this hideout. Thank you. I will bear that in mind. Okay, um... I really don't know what's going on. I don't understand after that, but what's... I have a feeling that this guy's crying because the one Fergal killed was like his friend or something, maybe? Eternal gratitude oh. for your protection, master. Oh, okay. No actual dialogue with him. Well, what else do we got? What about you? You are one to trust. Well, I don't get this. Like, Old Bridget keep your distance, Echo. I thought Escalon has stalked us for ages upon ages. I thought they were all feral and crazed, just like Jonathan said. How are they like talking to me? You know, when they attack me, like, they definitely... Oh, I guess this is... a hideout. Well, I don't want to leave just yet. Uh, I mean, at least we can use, like, our vampires in full view, like, if we need to teleport or something. Man, this shotgun came in clutch against that guy. Can I talk to you? No. Eternal gratitude for your 
I, for your I don't know what to think now, because I've killed so many of these skulls under the impression that they were all crazy and, like, insane, like, unredeemable. You know, they just attack me on sight, attack anyone on sight. But now it's like, oh yeah, they're, they're cool and they can talk and they're trained to live down here peacefully, but the ones up on the surface, they... I, don't, I just don't know. <laughs> We're at your mercy. Vampire, I told you. Oh, Alright. Oh, shit. Okay, well, let's go talk to Harriet. Seems we've got a few ways. So, we got to talk to Harriet. There is a, a door down here, I think it was. Uh, no, was it upset? Wait, did I check here? I don't think I did. Shit, there's like three places I need to go. There's the hideout door, there's Harriet, and then there's a way out over there. Oh, wow, she's actually like sitting. What's this note? Supremacy of Ekons. It is no coincidence that Ekons are the most eminent and most numerous of all vampires. Ekons are the true aristocracy of immortals, and if I may add, they are the only ones able to stay at the top of the food chain. Everywhere I travelled, I only met Ekons assuming mortal lives or forming an immortal society. Ekons are the most human, most clever, and most educated of all vampires. Don't get me wrong here, I have nothing against more exotic species like Volcord, who share the gift of immortality immortality with us, most of them can prove useful, if properly canalized towards a clear goal, but they lack the most important trait of all, the ability to mingle with mortals without being spotted. Yeah, that would be fairly important. Therefore, the Ascalon Club should only accept Ekon of the highest lineage as member of its inner circle. Depending on circumstances, Volkos could be accepted as war dogs or hunting hounds as long as they obey our laws. Luckily enough, these lesser cousins have a natural tendency to submit and obey their masters. Well, like I said, sort of like a class system where Ekons are like treated better than all the others. But is she a skull? Oh shit, look at her foot. What's Hello, up with that? You and her arm. Hmm, yes, you were from the Pembroke Hospital. The young doctor. So full of secrets. I have so many questions I need to ask you, Harriet. If you would. I love questions. As for the answers, you may not like them. Okay. Why fake your death? Yeah. I assume that is what happened. Your room. The blood. What brought you to fake your death in such a gruesome fashion? To see if I would be mourned. Why? Why flee with Sean Hampton? Oh, it's always a pleasure to see a saint fall to sin. But the coward still won't kill. I really don't get some of these characters. Do you take pleasure in causing so much pain and sorrow? Nobody gave a damn about me. Not a tear shed. Poor Harriet. Always the discarded. Maybe because you're an asshole to everyone. Why did you come here? And why not? This is where I live now. Leave me be. Will you obey old Bridget? I doubt Will it. You respect old Bridget's wishes? Will you obey her? Bridget is kind. She only needs to keep me fed and I'll be good. <laughs> so you desire to stay here? Yes. I'm with my own kind. Birds of a feather, so to speak. Poor Harriet. Always alone. Was she a skull the whole time? Like, how do you feel? I don't get it. I can't see. I can't. 
can't move. Oh my, my body's burning. I feel as if I'm dying over and over again. God, I wouldn't even want to be alive at that point. Have you tried to eat or drink something? People here tried to feed me, but I'm just not hungry. I don't have the strength. Does the pain ever stop? It is not pain I feel. It's like I, I can't stop feeling every inch of my body. But at the same time, each muscle and bone is the wrong place. I don't get it. I have a question of the utmost importance to ask. Will you answer? Questions, questions, questions. The good doctor always searching for answers. Do you remember what you did after leaving the hospital? Did you kill anyone? First, a question from me. You answer first. Very well, then. What do you want to know? Are you like me? Are you also dead? I'm no skull. I'm nothing like you. We are both undead. Uh, well, I'm definitely not a skull. And in terms of personality and whatnot, we're nothing like her. I have a feeling that this is going to be a choice that is going to matter. But we are both undead, so that's true. So let's go for this one. We are not dead, Harriet. Death no longer pertains to us. We are different. I like what I am. I truly do. I relish the pain that courses through me. I know you fled the hospital with Sean Hampton. Did you or Sean kill anyone in your flight? Anyone? Try and remember. I will not lie. I wanted blood and I wanted revenge and Sean pulled me from it. Brought me here instead. But the shadows heard my prayers. The shadows killed that bastard. Who? Who was that man? The one murdered in the street? He used to be my landlord. I lived here for many years before falling ill. Oh, he was an awful man. Disgusting and cruel. So cruel. Don't lie. Okay. You sought vengeance by your own hand, and someone else obliged you. Very convenient. Don't lie to me. I don't lie. I saw him near the docks, and rightly I wished him dead. And I am happy he is. It's true. But I didn't kill him. I was too tired. Did we see this person already? Or are we going to go investigate them? I don't know. So I'm a little unsure on that one. Shadows. Tell me what you saw. The shadows. They heard me and answered. Something in the deep darkness. Quick. Deadly. It asked me if I wanted revenge. I answered, yes. And these shadows, this presence, do you still hear it? Was it a vampire? Did Sean see it? It spoke only to me. And now it is silent. But it is born of hatred. <laughs> and it will kill again. <laughs> and it hates you, Doctor. Oh, it hates you. What makes you say that? It, it whispered your name, Dr. Reed. It wanted to know who you were and where you went. Questions about me. Why? What did you say? Nothing, Doctor. I said nothing. There was nothing it didn't already know. Oh, I'm tired now. Let me rest. God. It's like every conversation I have with these guys, I just, I always end, uh, leave with more questions. Have you found the answers you were looking for, young Echo? No. There is too much left unanswered. Yeah. So many questions. So many. Get to know us. Spend time with us. And I may be willing to answer more questions. What are you, like a seer? 
How long have you been hiding here? Probably a long time. For how long have you been in hiding here? Skulls have been hiding under London since vampires first entered the city. Where did you hide before the sewers? We claimed ancient tunnels, forgotten caverns, catacombs. We are skulls groveling beneath the feet of our makers. Who are you? And yeah, wh uh, why live here is pretty obvious because there'd be nowhere else to live. Like, maybe out in the mountains or the forest or something, but, you know, they'd probably get found there eventually. Your diction, your words. You do not carry yourself like most skulls I've encountered. True. I'm not like most skulls. What happened? You were once someone else. What happened to you? It is as sad as it is long, young Ekon, but it will remain mine. All right, fair call. Can I be of service to you? We ask but one thing. Reveal to no one our secrets. Do not betray us. I won't. Why do you live here, amongst the filth and vermin? Live. Here we hide. Yeah, that pretty much what I meant before. What are you hiding from? From the guilt, the shame, from the hunters and the light. And of course, our past. Wonder what happened in the past. Why don't you leave the city? Hide somewhere far from the guard of Prewan, the Ascalon Club. We are the Sewer Skulls. This is our domain. We have run as far as we can, and now we hide. Yeah, I mean, the Ascalon Club wouldn't accept them because they're like the scum of the vampires or whatever. They're lesser vampires, so they don't want them. What manner of creature is Harriet? She is different from everyone else. I really don't know. I'm not even certain she is a skull. I've no idea as to what blood made her. What is a skull, in fact? In your honest opinion. The progeny of a vampire, disavowed by her maker. Perhaps a fruitless branch of a noble tree. A word used to enslave us. I cannot say. You mentioned that vampire blood has tremendous potency. You believe it to be stronger than your own? Ah, the vampire's sweet blood. That rich, dark wine that we crave. For it made us, and it can sustain us. I thank you for your time, madam. I must go back to Sean Hampton now. Yeah. Your kindness has been ample payment, Ekon. To protect us, I'll close the access to our hideout, but you can use our shortcut to reach Mr. Hampton's shelter. Thank you. Just follow the arrows. Thank you. Okay, well, before I do that, I want to go up and... It's up there. Staircase. I want to go to the hideout and like, get my blood back and level up my bloody abilities. I'm pretty sure that I can now... Oh, no, that lead, that will lead back out to the... To Hampton. And I've still got two other places to search. So let's go and do that. Down here, there's one. And then there's another one up further upstairs. Embankment sewers. Yeah, so I didn't look through here. Oh, fuck, there's a fair bit to look through. Oh, well, oh, who are you? Are you all right, sir? What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. Don't you know this is a quarantine zone? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm investigating the epidemic. You had better get to a safe place while you still can. Oh, really? Well, go investigate somewhere else. And leave me be. I beg your pardon. I said go. Leave me alone, sir. Okay, well, I guess we'll find out what's up with him at a later date. He doesn't want to talk. He's, he's living right next to the skulls. Like, what's up with that? Yeah, so we can't actually get through here. So that's one one place that we've uh, fully searched. So there'll be nothing up here apart from that guy for, I guess, when we find out what his quest is later on. 
back in the sewer skulls territory and we've got the last one over here I believe uh, so it said to follow the arrows and yeah the arrows go that way all right so she said to follow the arrows and that will lead us back to Sean but I don't want to do that just yet I guess maybe the hideout over here doesn't uh, take us back to Sean and I want to bloody level up so bad want to make my uh, ultimate do more damage Oh, yes. New weapon, even. Common mace. What else do we have? Yeah, refill my bullets. And a crafting place. Yes. Okay. I still can't upgrade that. So that's 15 attack speed. Uh, 20 stamina. Oh, that's a two-hand. Uh, uh, the secondary weapons are just too good. And I still need better handle parts. Uh, so what I'm going to do is we are going to level up this ultimate here. I believe I can now. Yep, two. Wait, so that does. T so it goes 250 all the way to three. Uh, 200 all the way to 350. So that's pretty bloody good. That's. Oh, that's only a 50 damage increase. Then. Oh, that. This is, like, barely even worth getting. Unless it, like, travels to more targets or something. Like, 250 to... At uh, 200 to 350 is a really big increase. But then only, like, 50, then 100, then another 100. That's pretty underwhelming. Uh, but, yeah, I want to carry more serums. These... Uh... I didn't bother with these serums at all earlier, but I think they're really good after using them. So let's uh, confirm this and hopefully the, yeah, the following, my oh god, I really hope that these districts have, okay, so this appears to be okay. Oh shit, he's still got a migraine. Oh shit, she, we dropped 2%. So she's got a cold now, migraine, fatigue, 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 neuralgia. God, he's not doing too good at all. And, oh yeah, you're, you're still the same, thankfully. But let's craft these uh, bloody serums now. Oh, what's this? Sturdy blood Oh, analyze. Yes, give me migraine things. Oh, damn it, it's for a serum. Oh, that's not, like, terrible, but I, I want these. I want the treatments. So, blood serums. Make all the blood serums. Uh, that's a light stamina. And we will use the health ones as well. We have plenty of that material. Um, I, I need plenty of uh, the fatigue ones. I think I need, like maybe even more than that uh how about you yeah so we need two more good trigger parts all right so that's uh oh, i didn't get any blood back shit oh actually what if i do this g uh, i can only use it when i'm in combat the serum i was going to use my serums and then uh just make a few more and then get back on the road uh, but I can't do that. Seems I can only use them in combat. Alright, so... The arrows go off in this direction, up to old Sean. So let's get out of this place. Oh, God. What a journey this was. Enter at your own risk. Yeah, that's definitely a big risk, alright. So that's locked. I guess we use this. That'll unlock it, maybe? Yep, there we go. Good. Ah, loading screen. Okay, loading screen is over. Uh, but I will end this one here. And we'll go talk to uh, Sean and like see what the go is in the next one. And we've also got to go back to the hospital and talk to Swansea and Lady Ashbury. Uh, but we'll do that in the next one. Keen to see what happens with that. Peace in the Middle East and may all your games be good ones.